Hey guys, welcome to Tony's How To's. In this video, I will show you how to convert QuickTime video to MP4. So before we start, hurry up and check out our latest offer just under this video. So let's get started. Now for you to convert your QuickTime video to MP4, the first thing that we want to do here is we want to install a software that you could con that you could use to convert your video. So in this case, we want to download VLC Media Player. Now, where do you download VLC Media Player? So you could go ahead and go to videoland.org slash VLC and you'll be redirected here and just click on download and you'll be able to download the .exe file and basically just install VLC into your PC. Now in here, it's going to start the download. Once it finished downloading, go ahead and just install your uh, that .exe file here or install VLC here. And once you've installed it, you could just basically just open this up. So no worries, installing VLC is pretty easy. You just need to follow the on-screen steps and you should be good. But yeah, once you've installed that, let's just go ahead and open up VLC Media Player. Now in here, what you need to do is you want to go to media at the top left of your screen and you want to select convert slash save or you could use control R if you want to. Then here we want to add a the file that we want to convert. So currently I have this file here, which is the, the a dot mov here and we want to choose this one and just click on open. Now from here, let's just click on convert slash save. Now in here, we want to choose the correct settings for our video. So in this case, by default, it's not be going to be set to MP4. So make sure that you use MP4 for the profile for this one. So usually I use this one, which is H.264 plus MP3, which is MP4 in turn here. So choose this one. Now we want to change or basically uh, set, set the settings for our audio on our video. So you need to click on this uh, edit selected profile here, the icon here, just click on that and you want to go to audio codec. And in here, we want to uh, make sure that this uh, setting here that says keep original audio track is enabled so that we won't be changing the audio to keep our audio here and just click on save. Now from here, we want to choose our destination file. Just click on browse and you'll be able to choose the location. So in this case, let's just download this or enter this in our desktop. And in this case, I just want to name this as converted and just click on save. Also, when you add or you add your name here, make sure that you change this instead of MOV, make sure that you input MP4 for this one. Because if you retain MOV on this one, you're not basically you're not uh, converting your video. So make sure that you input MP4 here because by default, it's going to be MOV, which is kind of tricky. So make sure that you don't forget to change the file extension itself. Yeah, so here, let's just input MP4. Again, click on save. Again, click on the start here and it's going to start our process. From here, let's just go back here. And as you can see, it is the MP4. So if you didn't change the name, it's going to be that MOV. So let's just delete this one. So this is the correct one, which is that MP4. And that's about it. So thank you for watching. If you have any questions, feel free to ask in the comment section. If you enjoyed this video and found it helpful, you could use the link in the description to subscribe. See you in the next video.